Africa, a land of wonders and mysteries. Join us as we uncover the top 10 baffling phenomena in Africa that have left scientists scratching their heads. Are you ready to listen? Our first mystery will leave you questioning reality itself. Deep in the heart of New Mexico, a low frequency hum permeates the air. For decades, residents of Taos have reported hearing this enigmatic hum, a sound that seems to emanate from the very earth itself. Some believe it's a natural phenomenon, perhaps the result of shifting tectonic plates or underground water flow. Others whisper of secret government experiments or even extraterrestrial activity. Is it a collective hallucination? A trick of the mind? Or something more profound? And just when you thought it couldn't get weirder, we journey to the arid plains of Namibia, where another enigma awaits, the fairy circles. Scattered across the landscape, as far as the eye can see, are millions of barren circles each one perfectly formed. Some scientists believe the circles are the work of termites, their underground activity creating the unique patterns. Others propose the circles are formed by competing plant species, vying for scarce resources in the harsh desert environment. Science or myth? The jury is still out on the true nature of the fairy circles. Could this be the work of ancient civilizations? Deep within the rainforest of the Congo, hidden amongst the dense foliage and ancient trees, lies a secret that resonates with the echoes of the past, the singing stones of the Congo. These are no ordinary stones. When struck with a mallet, they produce a sound unlike anything you've ever heard. Local legend claims the stones possess a spiritual energy, a connection to the ancestors and the spirit world. Scientists, however, are searching for a more earthly explanation. Could the unique acoustic properties of the stones be the result of their mineral composition? Chapter 4. This next one will send chills down your spine. In the depths of the Peruvian Amazon, shrouded in mist and legend, flows a river unlike any other, a river so hot it boils. The locals call it Chane Tempishka, meaning boiled with the heat of the sun. Scientists have been left baffled by the source of the river's heat. The boiling river remains a place of both wonder and danger, a stark reminder of the raw power that lies beneath the Earth's surface. Chapter 5. Ever seen something so strange you had to laugh? Well, get ready for a story that will leave you both amazed and bewildered. Imagine this. You're going about your day in the small town of Yoro, Honduras, when suddenly the sky opens up and instead of rain, fish start falling from the clouds. Yes, you heard that right, fish raining from the sky. Every summer, usually between May and July, this bizarre phenomenon known as the Luvia de Peces or rain of fish takes place. It's a sight to behold as the heavens seem to shower the town with a bounty of aquatic life. Hundreds of live fish, typically small silverfish, rain down upon the town, carpeting the streets and fields. The locals gather them up, often using them as a source of food. It's both a blessing and a mystery. The scientific community has offered several theories to explain this meteorological mystery. Researchers have been intrigued by this event for years, trying to uncover the secrets behind it. One popular hypothesis is that water spouts, or tornadoes over water, suck up the fish from the nearby Atlantic Ocean and deposit them inland. These water spouts can travel great distances, carrying their aquatic cargo with them. Despite the theories, the rain of fish remains one of nature's most enduring enigmas. It's a reminder of how much we still have to learn about the world around us and the incredible phenomena that can occur. Chapter 6 Scientists are racing against time to understand this. In the desolate heart of the Sahara Desert, a giant blue eye stares up at the heavens. This is the Richar structure, also known as the Eye of the Sahara, a geological formation so vast it's visible from space. Initially, it was thought to be the impact crater of a massive meteorite. The current scientific consensus is that the eye is a geological dome formed by millions of years of erosion and uplift. 
whatever its origins, the Eye of the Sahara remains a breathtaking testament to the power of geological forces. Chapter 7. The Lake of Exploding Methane Deep within the African rainforest, nestled amongst dense vegetation and teeming with life, lies a lake harboring a deadly secret. Lake Kivu, shared by the Democratic Republic of Congo and Rwanda, is no ordinary body of water. Beneath its serene surface, lurking in its depths, lies a vast reservoir of methane gas and carbon dioxide, trapped for millennia. Scientists believe that a volcanic eruption or even a large landslide could trigger a catastrophic release of these gases, resulting in a limnic eruption. Lake Kivu stands as a stark reminder of the delicate balance of nature. Chapter 8. The Stone Forest of Madagascar On the island of Madagascar, a land renowned for its unique and diverse ecosystem, lies a landscape so bizarre it seems plucked from the pages of a fantasy novel. This island, often referred to as the Eighth Continent due to its rich biodiversity, is home to many wonders, but none as striking as the Stone Forest. This is the Tsingi de Bemaraha National Park, home to the extraordinary Stone Forest. The park itself is a UNESCO World Heritage Site, recognized for its unique geological formations and the rare species that inhabit it. Imagine a vast expanse of razor-sharp limestone pinnacles, some towering over 100 feet high. These formations, known as Tsingi, are so sharp and dense that they are nearly impenetrable, creating a natural fortress. Over millions of years, rainwater, slightly acidic from the atmosphere, has slowly dissolved the limestone bedrock, carving out a labyrinth of canyons, caves, and these iconic razor-sharp peaks. This process, known as karstification, has sculpted the landscape into a maze of stone. The stone forest of Madagascar is a testament to the power of nature to both create and destroy. It stands as a monument to the relentless forces of erosion and time, showcasing the delicate balance between the elements and the earth. Chapter 9. The Lost City of the Kalahari Legends whisper of a lost city swallowed by the sands of the Kalahari Desert a place of unimaginable wealth and splendor. This city, shrouded in mystery, is said to have been a thriving metropolis, teeming with life and prosperity, before it vanished without a trace. For centuries, explorers and adventurers have scoured the vast expanse of the Kalahari, searching for any trace of this fabled city. They have braved the scorching heat the relentless sandstorms and the treacherous terrain, driven by tales of untold riches and ancient secrets waiting to be uncovered. Some dismiss it as mere folklore, a figment of imagination fueled by the harsh desert conditions. They argue that the stories are nothing more than mirages, illusions created by the mind in the face of the desert's unforgiving nature. But others cling to the belief that the lost city of the Kalahari is more than just a myth. They point to ancient maps, cryptic journals, and mysterious artifacts as evidence that the city once existed and may still lie buried beneath the shifting sands. The search for the lost city of the Kalahari continues driven by a thirst for discovery and a desire to uncover the secrets of the past. Modern archaeologists and passionate adventurers alike are determined to solve this ancient enigma, hoping to one day reveal the hidden treasures and forgotten history of this legendary city. Chapter 10. The Mysterious Lights of Marfa in the vast, desolate expanse of West Texas, where the stars seem to hang just a little bit closer to the earth, lies a small town harboring a big secret Marfa. For over a century, strange lights have been reported dancing across the horizon, flickering orbs of light that appear on clear nights, their origin unknown. Some believe them to be atmospheric phenomena, perhaps swamp gas or ball lightning. Others whisper of UFOs and extraterrestrial visitors drawn to this remote corner of the world. 
The Marfa lights stand as a testament to the enduring power of mystery. From the eerie hum in the desert to the fish falling from the sky, these mysteries remind us how much we still have to learn about our world. They challenge our assumptions, ignite our curiosity, and remind us that even in the age of information, there are still wonders beyond our comprehension. If you enjoyed this journey, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more incredible discoveries. What other mysteries could be out there waiting to be uncovered?